What's going on everybody? Pritigan here. And if you're like me, June of 2021 this year, Riot announced that Valorant is coming to mobile. Fantastic. But since then, we have received no information, no sneak peeks, not nothing from the Riot developer team until now. So here we are, guys. We are right now on LinkedIn. And if you do not know what LinkedIn is, it is a social media platform that is built primarily for professional networking. So people within various careers, gaming, technology, marketing, whatever. I received a notification from LinkedIn two days ago that Riot has posted some new positions. I, of course, I'm, you know, I always take a look and I see mobile and Valorant in the titles and i'm like whoa wait a second so i went ahead and i searched you know mobile valorant on their jobs with riot games and i see that they have posted some job listings specifically towards mobile performance on valorant mobile generalist on valorant mobile game designer or senior game designer for mobile on valorant a level two researcher for mobile valorant and i'm like okay this is interesting let's go directly to the source so we are on riotgames.com work with us i'm going to search for valorant mobile and there it is it's right here so the level two researcher is specifically on insights <clears throat> senior game designer you know that's that's key a senior software engineer for mobile on valorant a senior software engineer for performance on mobile focused around M Valorant. And then, you know, there's the keywords for Valorant brings up some, you know, manager for video video effects. Nonetheless, this is really important for those of us who want to get some information of what's going on at Riot Games surrounding Valorant Mobile. Because as we all know, we're expecting to probably not get anything from Riot this year. We're already in October of this when this video is being recorded. October is Q4 of 2021. So we're already towards the tail end of this year. We're hopefully maybe going to get some information come 2022. Do I personally believe that we're going to get anything January, February, or March? So the first quarter of 2022? I don't think so. A lot of these positions coming from a development background are pretty core, right? So insights is, you know, basically someone who's looking at data and being able to make decisions that influence the product. You, you have two senior um positions you have a game designer and a software engineer focused on mobile and you have a staff software engineer as well which is a pretty high level so just to make sure that we're not talking about the riot mobile app right because we all know they recently released an app for your mobile devices uh very similar to i guess like battle.net from blizzard but like let's just click on one of them right Researcher 2 for Mobile Valorant. So this is, of course, in Los Angeles. That's where um, I think one of their headquarters is. As researcher, you will join the Insights Discipline. Uh, you'll be part of an interdisciplinary team close with writers from other disciplines, designers, artists, and so on. As a researcher on Valorant, you'll be working with the platform extensions team supporting the development of the mobile version of Valorant. So there you go. This is really important. First off, if you are in the industry and you are looking for something of this and you want to work on Valorant Mobile with Riot Games, take a look at these positions. These may be something for you guys. But in the meantime, this is really great news, in my opinion. They're continuing to increase the team, which means that development is kicking off. Do we know how far? No. Do we have any insight on anything development wise no idea but this is just really good insights knowing that riot didn't make an announcement and there's nothing about it we have positions available they are growing their valorant mobile team so this is super great news i'm highly expecting that we should be getting some sort of information sometime next year maybe middle of next year i'm not sure I do know that they were focusing and potentially looking at if there would be any sort of betas that it would be uh, primarily in Southeast Asia as you know they've done similar with um, Wild Rift for League of Legends mobile 
So I wouldn't be surprised if they follow the same pattern of releases that they did with Wild Rift for Valorant Mobile. But until then, we'll make sure that we can kind of keep our eyes off on anything for Valorant Mobile. It's, it's really important. And, you know, to keep this also in the back of your minds, there was a game that was being developed by NetEase Games called Project M. It was a very big Valorant Mobile clone or whatever we would assume Valorant Mobile to be. They had their first beta that was closed beta. And since then, that game has completely gone quiet. Their Facebook group has gone quiet. There's been no new news on anything. So is Riot pushing back on other game developers because they're already getting closer to having something to release? We don't know. But rest assured, until then, I will be keeping my eye out for you guys and being providing any sort of information we have regarding Valorant Mobile. I'm really excited about this game and I'm sure you guys are too if you're watching this video. And if you guys are watching until then, please smash that like button and subscribe to my channel as I will be providing you guys up-to-date information as I get it regarding Valorant Mobile. Until then guys, talk to you later.